Hey hello guys welcome back to my channel my name is Sagar Prajapati and in this video I am going to explain you about a question which I have gotten from the LinkedIn post and I thought to solve this question using my way okay and it's it this question was asked in the EY uh, EY uh, company for data for data engineer role okay so the question is saying that we are giving this uh, data frame okay you can see we have job status and run underscore date so we have fail status and success status and in in we have two rows in the fail and three rows in the success and we have corresponding dates also right now what we want to build we want to build something we want to build something this job status fail the start date and the end date then when success happens what is the start date what is the end and date and if there are any break then again i have to you know um, i have to you know add a new row success and then this 13 and this is the end date right so what i meant is that see we have fail fail this is a continuation like 3 and 4 this is a serial order right so what i did i added fail start date is this and end date is this for success you can see these two are the consecutive and it has some break so for success since there is no end date so i consider the same date as an end date so in order to achieve this what we have to do is see what i did think about it first stop this video and think about it how we can solve this problem so here you can easily say hey what if if i do a a uh, kind of group by based on uh, on top of job underscore status and I can get the min and I can get the max okay this is the straight forward question of I mean straight forward answer but in this case you will lose or you will uh, miss the corner cases that there is a uh, I mean I need to find out the continuity also right so in if I if I go with this way in for, for these rows success 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 then I will get success, I mean the uh, start date is 0, 01 and end date is the 813. I will miss this, right. Ideally the, uh, the solution or the answer would be uh, these two rows and then this, this row, right. So I need to break it. So in order to break, in order to you know break the uh, you know what we can say partition, I mean in order to create a new partition, uh, right what i have to do i have to add some kind of new column which will tell hey where, where there is a break or no right there is a continuity break or not right so that's what what i'm gonna do i'm gonna do a partition by on job status on job status order by run date okay that makes sense this is the one uh, one window function i'm gonna use row number another i'm i'm gonna use without any partition okay so what will happen if i if i run this d uh, so what i did with column rn uh, row number job status you know and then rn all correct and then group by i mean grp group uh, job run status minus this so let's see you know what it gives us see it gives us one two oh okay one minute yeah it gives us one two and then it, it gives a one two three because i use the partition job status this comes into the this comes under the one uh you know one partition and this comes under the three party i mean into one partition in rn underscore all what i have used i have not used any partition over there and i'm using row uh, and i what i'm using what I am using order by RN date. So RN date is what? This is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And I am I am checking here the difference. Right? Since these two are the same, so it gives me 0. And these are giving me here minus 2. Okay? And then, then what I do? I do a group by based on job status okay and and this grp okay you will see this will create one one kind of uh, group and this will create another group and this will create another group 
right this is how i got the answer right now after that if if you are liking this video if you like this video if you uh, understood the question and if you want to practice more you can go and check out this course practice 50 pi spark interview questions i have you know like there are lot of questions around 44 45 questions is there with the solutions also given in the this 50 pi spark interview uh, question underscore final this is the notebooks i have attached and if you want you can enroll into it and there is a coupon called the shara going on if you like you can go ahead and you know enroll into it and you will get a better understanding of uh, you know like how to solve these questions in, in 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 your interview and definitely you will find out similar questions in your interview too right so what i'll do i'll just do a quickly display okay so i'll store this and maybe and also you can use lead or lag function okay you can use lead or lag function also now you can see this is the answer this is what you know it is showing understood you see instead of you uh, instead of doing double double uh, you know double double uh, row number you can also use lead function or lag function try to build the solution in that way and uh, comment in the uh, you know comment your solutions in the comment box so that you know everyone will learn it right till then thank you bye bye we'll meet you in the next lecture